Today, we are going to be reviewing the new PVC gallery diorama of Moon Knight. That's right. This is Moon Knight as he appeared on Disney+. Plus. It is designed by the Silver Brothers. It is sculpted by Eduardo Tarahiro. And hopefully, it is worth the $60 price tag that it has. Now, you can pick these up at Diamond Select Toys. I always say, please buy from your local comic book store and order it. They'll probably have it right on the shelf. Uh, if you go to the Disney outlet or store, these bad boys are there. I just went to one. There was a whole bunch. Uh, so we're going to be checking out this diorama, checking out little details. And as I love, love to say, it's always about the base and the character. Here we go. All right, so we've got him out of the box here. He's inside the plastic coffin. I love the fact that um, Diamond Select uh, gives you a window box, but you really can't see it because of the glare of the plastic, but it is very well protected inside the plastic coffin. So we're just gonna slice the tape right here, kind of holds it all together. And did you sometimes there's more than one piece? Looks like there may be on this one. Nope, just a lot of buttons. So we'll pop it out of here, take a look, and we'll do a slow reveal. So, um, I'll say that I did really like the series. I thought it was one of the better Marvel series. Definitely different. Ooh. So the thing that really grabs my attention right away is the hands. We have great detail. We have separate fingers. You can actually make it out. And the bandages are really detailed. This is not painting. This is actually, um, it's sculpted into the design, the gauntlets here. Um, and then we have the nice little moons, moons you know, all over the place where you really need it to be. It's very light. It is definitely a PVC piece. Uh, the cape has a little bit of give. And what I like about these is, is that they're actually affordable. Um, 60 bucks does not seem as much as when you talk about a, a $100, $200, $300 statue or bust. But, you know, this is something, and it, it, has, it survives the cat test. So if a cat goes, boom, and knocks them off the bookshelf, it's nice, but if you're just looking at it, you love the design, you have this with your Moon Knight comics, your Marvel books, um, this is a nice design. And think about it. You'd spend $25 on an action figure, you'd probably put them in such a cool pose that the cape's not going to be as flowing as this, as nice as this, the gray detail is really nice. Um, and a fine distinction between this gray and that gray, which is cool. But on the inside, it works very well, so they're kind of like more of the dark gray. Um... You would end up doing this pose anyway. So, yeah, if you're an adult collector, you're probably not doing a lot of toy playing downstairs in the basement or outside and having backyard adventures. But you're probably going to have him posed. Uh, so definitely, ooh, 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 ooh. So here's more details. So we have some we have some writing here on the legs. Very nice. Look at that. It's on both sides. So we have some, yeah. Uh, hieroglyphics right here on that. What a great detail. And in, and you see a little bit on the inside of the leg. I to, I'm trying to catch the light, but it's in here as well, right there. So really nice detail. Um, and a fantastic turn uh, by Diamond Select. I mean, this is a really uh, cool piece. The base is nice. We get a little bit of the Egyptian feel there. And this rock, this could be solid underneath, and I'm really nitpicking when I say that, but it probably saves on weight and saves on plastic. So i, I got to give it a nice... It's a really nice uh, addition to your collection. Here, we'll do some height. We're talking about nine inches. Here's a Kenner uh, Endor Han Solo original. Gives you an idea of the size of it. And then we'll bring in a archived uh, Boba Fett Black Series figure. So there's your scale of what you're looking at. I mean, it's about a seven-inch figure. It's a good deal. If it was a figure, seven-inch size, but he's crouching. Um, this is Bob from Total Story Recon, thanking Diamond Select for sending him out. I love it. Looks great. Thank you.